Hey guys, this is Patricia Montero, outside hitter for the KU volleyball team. Um, we're here at the Bruce Center on campus. Everyone's eating lunch, I just got done. Um, I'm taking over the NCAA volleyball Twitter account. Um, I read all of your questions and I'm excited for this little Q&A to start. Okay, so now we're here in the tutoring center where all the studying and all the magic in the classroom happens. Um, up here, just found out we have our Puerto Rican flag, super excited. And to answer your question, Amber, um, I started playing when I was about eight, nine years old um, back in Puerto Rico. And I was a setter till I was about 15 when I grew a little couple of inches and they then I became a hitter when I was 15. So now I'm here in the Coach B's office. Hey Pat. How's it going? Doing good, how are you today? Good, good, yeah. answering a little Q&A. Um, I'm gonna give you guys a little tour. So here we have our 2015 Final Four picture. He got the lights on, real cool. And there he is again. Panoramic view. <laughs> um, to answer your question, KU leads, what does it mean to be a Jayhawk? Um, I think it means that you're part of something bigger than yourself. You know, you're part of a family. And like in every family, you have responsibilities. And in this one, it's just to be the best that you can be every day and inspire others to do the same. I think you owe them that much. Okay, so I'm here with our sports psychologist, Dr. Scott Ward. Hello there, Jayhawks. Um, to answer your question, Katie, to anyone suffering from a season-ending injury, I would say to um, trust that everything happens for a reason, to take it day by day, and to uh, put in the work to get back. Um, I just want to share that Scooter here was a big part of me, um, getting over the process and kind of coming back into playing this year, so thank you. She did great. She stayed positive and you heal better when you're happy. True, I agree. So I'm out here with the people I call my sunshine, Allie Nelson Hello. and Cameron Ennis. Hi. And to answer your question, Jordan, um, I'm looking forward to finally being out there with my teammates. Um, we have a really young team, so we are excited for, you know, the change and the challenge that comes with it. So I'm in Billy's office. I'm about to um, crush a film session right here. Hey! What's up, Pat? <laughs> Hi! Hey. I'm here with Machi and Billy. Chalk, baby. So to answer your question, Billy, because this isn't weird. Where do you see yourself in five years? Um, I want to go to law school, actually. So hopefully I'm about to finish law school in five years. So, I like that. Yeah. Law school rocks. That's the dream. So for those who don't know, this is our facility, the Horse Family Athletic Center, where the magic happens. So I come out here to show you guys. And I see Jackie Hi, just guys. sitting on the floor. Why? <laughs> it's perfect weather, so I thought I'd come out and enjoy it. Perfect weather. Cloudy. But okay. I'm not judging. I'm not judging. But to answer your question, Camden, um, coming back from surgery, you know, there's ups and downs. The body can feel good one day, not so good the other. But I rely on my teammates, like Jackie here, to keep me up, keep me motivated. And, you know, it's all about getting the work done. So I'm here with the person I spend the most time with. Hello. This is our athletic trainer, Ann Wallace. She is our rock star behind the scenes. This one was the rock star behind she the scenes. She got me back. And to answer your question, Maggie, um, the best advice came from Ann, actually. She shoots me a text before every game. Um, it says, take pride in how far you've come, have faith in how far you can go, but never forget to enjoy the journey. And I appreciate you so, so, so much. I appreciate you back. You did all the work and you kicked butt doing it. So to continue the tour, we are in the Anderson Family Strength Center. Um, we come here every day before practice. We actually have a session in about an hour. Um, and to answer your question, I really enjoy going to Fort Worth. Um, TCU's gym is actually um, kind of tight, you know, it's a great crowd. It gets loud um, and I really like the atmosphere. So I'm here in front of the DeBruce Center next to our statue of Dr. Naismith. He is the inventor of basketball and our first coach here. No big deal, but Loki, it is a big deal. 
um, to answer your question, number 13, um, I picked it because of my brother. We really, really look alike. We've always been really close. Love him. So I kind of just rolled with it. And then my favorite restaurant in Lawrence. I love Fozzie's Tacos. It's my go-to. Their shrimp burrito is amazing. You need to add sour cream inside, but other than that, highly recommend. So we're here inside of the Horse Family Athletic Center. This is Cameron Emmes putting in work before practice. Um, to answer your question, the best thing about being the Jayhawk is the feeling of having an extended family, the support system that they give you here, the fact that they care about you not only um, for your development in sports, but as a person as well, and the fact that you're positive and you're sure that you've built lifelong relationships that you can count on later in life. This is all the time I have today. We're about to go get treatment, then go to practice. I wanna thank you all for your questions. I really enjoyed it, had a blast. Um, hope you did too. Um, if I didn't get to yours, don't be afraid you know, to shoot me a DM. I'll be happy to answer. Um, other than that, just wanna tell y'all we're excited for season and you know we appreciate the support. Rock Chalk.